Okay guys, um, I'm getting ready to power it up, so let's switch on the power switch, there you go, and um, now let's power the whole thing up to say one third of one seventeen, that would be around about 40 volts. So let's go ahead and switch that on and here we go. Okay, we're at 40 volts. Uh, the display isn't working. The, neither is the pilot light, uh, but I don't see anything else working badly. I see no smoke, no, I smell nothing bad. So, okay, let's let's go up to 80 volts. Oh. As soon as I hit 45 volts, I hear a rattle inside the machine. I don't know what it is, but let's see. Okay, the rattle happened at about 45 volts, but I'm moving it up to 80 volts okay we're at 80 volts so let's see uh, I see no rattling no nothing but miracle of miracles the pilot light works and the display shows something I don't know what it is. Um, it shows all eights and pilot off and normal. Hmm. Okay, so a few things seem to work. I see no smoke coming from the power supply or anything like that. So, well, I suggest I uh, power it off. Power it up all the way to 110. Uh, so I switched it off and I'm going to take the voltage up to 117. There you go. Okay, we're at 117 volts AC. So, now we're going to switch the thing on. Ready guys? Here we go. Aha. I just heard a relay switching on. And the display is showing two STD TV. Well, I don't know what it means. Um, I suspect it means channel two standard television or something like that. And indeed, this switch is standing on standard television channel two, 69. Interesting. So, maybe we're lucky. Okay, let me see if I can hook it up to the oscilloscope and see whether I can get some sort of signal from the output. <laughs> 